At the peak of his career, Christian Blake was the man on everyone's lips. A man who was celebrated worldwide for his unparalleled musical talent. He was a friend of mine. He was a friend who was all. Singer, songwriter, and renowned musician. Christian was a man admired by many. With that admiration came a prize. A prize that would lead him into an unquenchable thirst. From the moment I met Christian, you could just tell that he had an addictive personality. It's funny. Looking back, I think I can pinpoint the exact evening when Christian became involved with water. He just had an insatiable thirst for the stuff. Christian already had it all. He had the money, he had the women. Hell, there were rumors out there that he had the men as well. Christian Blake, superstar. Australian rock god. You got your ACDC, you got your Casey Chambers. He was a part of the upper echelon of music, man. But over the horizon, that was Christian's career. Dark clouds were looming. Clouds that undoubtedly contained water. After the success of the first two albums, the critics were expecting a brand new hit record. But once he started on the water, the stuff he was writing was crazy. Absolutely crazy. It was at this point we knew it was taking a toll on Christian. We tried to hide it from the press, and we also tried to hide it from the public. And there were rumours, there was hearsay, there were stories. Christian is going to rehab. Unfortunately, as suspected, these rumours were true. But he broke out. He weren't there five minutes, and he was on the next train home. We found him lying next to a vending machine in Kui Rup. Struggling to keep his career afloat, Christian was caught in the riptide of the public eye. Christian's once sparkling career had become distilled. We always liked to joke that his sparkling career had become distilled. Bet you hadn't heard that one before. Today, Christian spends the majority of his time in his grave. Adored by many, Christian Blake will go down in the history books as a thirsty musician. A man who couldn't say no to H2O. A man who would give his first daughter for a glass of water. A true hero and liquid enthusiast. We salute you, Christian Blake. <laughs>